Keith Palmer had been a copper for 15 years, a husband, a dad, brother, uncle, public servant. Before joining the police, he'd been in the army defending our nation. Yesterday, he was murdered defending our democracy, defending the very heart of our democracy from a barbarian at the gate, just doing his duty, reminding us of something that we badly needed reminding, that the most important people in this country are not the rich, the powerful, the famous, but those who run to confront the enemies of our civilization or the rest of us are running away. First responders, like PC Palmer. Brutally stabbed to death by a jumped-up jihadi, not fit to breathe the same air as the man he killed. Now, I know there are still some jihadi johnnies out there who think they will eventually triumph because their love of death is greater than our love of life. So let me just say this to them. Do you have any idea who you're dealing with? This is the country that stood up alone to the might of the Luftwaffe, air force of the greatest evil mankind has ever known. If you think we're not going to be cowed by some pathetic poundland terrorist in an estate car with a knife, then you're as delusional as you are malevolent. Yes, you have the power to hurt us. Sometimes the hurt is more than we can bear. But you cannot defeat us, because for every brainwashed, brain-dead Islamist you send to do us harm, we have thousands upon thousands of Keith Palmers. You find them in every walk of life, in every part of the land. They come in all shapes, all sizes, all colours, all faiths. They are the British people, and against them you will never prevail.